have a review of the Dubai 210 Racer from GearBest. But first, let's see that beauty reel. This is a review of the 210 millimeter FPV racing drone kit from bestgear.com. Now, I've made a few adjustments to this, a few improvements, at least I thought. Um, it is a X frame with some extremely nice uh, Emax motors. Um, you may have noticed um, this crown on top. That's a little something that I've added. Uh, when I put on the camera, I got a Spectrum camera, which had this little controller board that I decided I'm going to mount there. And using some of the padding that came with the uh, motors, I made this little cushion bumper around there. And I can adjust the, um, the exposure for day, night. I can add my name to it. And I just thought I'd leave it on there and see how well that works. Um, as far as durability, it is a fairly thick carbon fiber, although I do think that the top plate is maybe a tad little thin for the uh, new flyer, such as myself. I did happen to uh, do a hard crash, and there's a little crack right there. And um, you know, I loosened the bolts and I straightened it out, and it was okay. It's 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 still completely flyable, but I think a, a thicker carbon at the top might have been a little bit more useful. Um, again, I noticed that the standoffs were missing. They originally intended for you to take the power supply board and mount it flat, flush, flush on the bottom of the frame. And I don't think that's a great idea. So I improved with the standoffs. Um, also, I had learned uh, from a crash. I had my antennas up here for my receiver and they kind of broke. So I, you might see I kind of like wired them up across the frame right there. And uh, I think that should keep them safe. Other than that, it's pretty much a very nice flyer. Uh, I would admit I am a terrible FPV drone pilot right now. I am learning. This again has no intelligence. It's not like a Phantom. And I gave it to one of my experienced friends at my uh, FPV racing club and he flew it around and it went beautifully. So kudos, um, highly do recommend this build for an experienced pilot. For a inexperienced pilot, I would say, take your time. It is tight in there. You might want to get a little help, but overall, I think you'll be very happy with this, uh, given enough practice. Anyway, again, this is the uh, Dubai 210 Racing Drone from GearBest. Please click and subscribe. I'm going to have a whole series of my experience building this, the complete noob build, being that I have never done this before. I had made lots of mistakes. You know, when you watch these videos of these pros building, they're perfect every time, <laughs> not me. I made mistakes and you can learn from my mistakes and build a perfect drone for yourself. Again, this is Joel Lightcatcher from the Light Tech channel. Please subscribe and um, happy flying.